Namaste friends, welcome back to Pavit Text Zone. In this video, we will see how to send the text message to a phone number. So let's get started. Open your manifest file and provide the permission to send a message. Uses permission and dot permission dot send SMS. Hover your cursor on the line and click on add uses feature tag. Close this file. Go to activity main.xml. Click on split. Say hello to this hello world and delete this. Change this constant layout to linear layout. And set orientation vertical, gravity center and padding 15 sp and create a edit text inside linear layout width will be match parent height will be wrap content give the hint as enter phone number and give the id as edit text and padding 15 sp max length 10 and input type phone and background for background you need to create one layout for that go to resource drawable click on new drawable resource file give the name as rect click on ok here you need to create a new image change the selector to the shape and provide the shape rectangle solid color as white then stroke width will be 1 dp and color color will be black corners radius to 5 dp Close this and here you need to pass the image. So as you can see rectangle is been displayed. Create one more edit text. Match parent. Height will be wrap content. And give the ID as edit, edit text message give it as edit text phone hint enter message padding will be 5 padding will be 15 sp input type text multi line lines will be 7 and background will be rect and margin top will be 15 dp and now create a button to submit the message wrap content height will be wrap content id ID will be button sent and text will be send SMS. 
layout margin top will be 30 dp so that's it we have designed the ui for the send message now go to main activity dot java here first we will initialize the variables so edit text edit text phone edit text message and button button sent next we will assign the variables edit text phone equals to find view by id r dot id dot edit text phone and edit text message change the id edit text message button sent equals to find view by id r dot id dot button sent hover your cursor on the line and click on message next button sent dot set on click listener new view on click listener first we will check the condition for permission for that if context compact dot check self permission main activity dot this manifest dot permission dot send sms equals to equals to package manager package manager dot permission granted so when permission is granted create a method send sms over the cursor on the send sms and click on create a method string phone equals to edit text phone dot get text to string string message equals to edit text message dot get text dot to string check condition if string is empty or not for that if not phone is empty not message is empty initialize sms manager so sms manager SMS manager equals to SMS manager dot get default SMS manager dot send text message phone null message null comma null so when we send a message we will display a message through toast toast give the message as sms sent successfully and when string is empty 
then we will display a toast message for that else toast and we will give the message as please enter phone and message and now we will write the else part else part for when the permission is not granted and we will request for the permission for that activity compact activity compact dot request permissions sorry main activity dot this new string manifest dot permission dot send sms and provide the request code as 100 and here if request code equals to equals to 100 and grant results dot length is greater than 0 and grant results of index 0 equals to equals to package manager dot permission granted so if permission is granted we will call the method send sms else When the permission is denied, we will display a toast message. For that toast, and the message will be permission denied. So we have written the code correctly with no errors. Now we will run our application. So as you can see, the code is successfully launched in the device. Now we should enter the phone number. I will enter my phone number and we will enter a message as hello Pavi text zone and we will send the message. So as you can see here, I have received the message as hello Pavi text zone. So this was all about today's video, how we, how we can send the normal text message to a phone number. If you are happy with my video, please like my video and subscribe my channel. Thank you.